Let's half tone this image for a black shirt for DTF. Old school, no plugins, just using Photoshop. So we'll bring out the layers menu. I'm just gonna drag this down to make a copy and then right click and convert this copy to a smart object. Now when we double click on it, it's going to open up that smart layer right here, but your original file is still sitting right here. So on this smart layer, we're going to go to mode grayscale and now bring out the levels. And I want to get in here really close because I want half toning to go all up through her face and only protect and turn white in this mask some of these lighter areas in her face. First, I'm going to move this shadow end all the way over to the top of this second peak. And now I'm going to drag up the highlights. And this is what I'm talking about. If this turns completely white, all of the original image will be protected where you see the white. But for this one, I want gray to be throughout her face. Now, wherever I have that gray, like here in her cheekbone and all around here in her nose, my goal is to make this as soft as possible and to use the least amount of ink possible. So once I have it set right there, I'll hit OK, go back up to image mode, bitmap, it'll have you flatten the layers and we want to be set to halftone screen. And instead of 35, we're going to jump up to 45. That's going to be a smaller dot, finer detail, angle of 26 and round. And remember, if you have a machine that's dialed in, you can handle those smaller dots. Now you can see the halftoning we have going on here. And if we go up to file, close, we'll want to save. And that temporary file disappeared and we're back on the original file. Now we can select all and then copy. And now I'm going to hide that mask layer that we just made, jump down to the original art and add a layer mask. Now you're going to hold down the option or alt key and click and then paste. Now, when we click back on the original art, you can see this is the only thing that's going to print on the transfer. And if we get up here really close, you see we've got a lot of half toning going on here. And that'll work. Remember, this is up to you. Now, if I come down here and hold the control or command and click the add layer button, it'll drop it underneath here and then hit shift delete and change this fill to black and hit OK. Now you see what this is going to look like on the black shirt. And if we get in here, you can see all the half toning we've got going on. Just remember, if you're going to print a transfer like this at 45 LPI, you need to make sure that you're working with a printer that can print this high detail. And in my case, in Digital Factory, I'm going to set the choke to two so that I can get white underneath all of these finer dots. This is gonna come out good. I'll print this out and show you in the next video.